Kamala Harris's extreme pro-abortion stance is morally indefensible. Wow, okay, we're gonna take this chair. Look at that. Hey, Ben. Like a bro, my friend. All right. I'm a transgender man. Okay. I've experienced SA. Okay. And abortion rights affect me directly. So, if we're talking about the American dream that you live, so, why don't I have access to that? Because there's no legislation, what, in the history of America that legislates a man's body, so why does mine have to be legislated? I've got a vagina. Um, I'm not interested in what your genitalia are. Clearly you are. I mean, it's all over uh, everything I'm, I'm, you I'm, make, no, buddy. I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry. I hate to say it to you, but... I think you can read on my face that I radically am not. Have. I think you can read on my face that I radically am not. When we're talking about abortion... No, I don't. The, the, I mean, you can present it here, but in most of the content that you have, you attack my community constantly. And you don't even realize guys like me exist who actually share a lot of similarities to you and everything, because I'm a married man of 20 years. I'm, I've got I a wife. I recognize that you exist. I disagree right, with your claim so that you're a male. Right, so if I was sexually assaulted, right... And I didn't have access to that abortion care. Do you believe that I should have carried that ter that child to term because I was sexually to, assaulted? I mean, the, so no. I just want to make sure that that's what you believe. Because as a transgender man, I have seen your side of the entire political debate, never ever having the conversation of what an American freedom is. Because why am I not allowed to live my American freedom as a man? I'm, you know, I mean, you I, get your as, choice as a man, as a man you're, to you're, live you're, and you're, free you're and all really, that. Kind. You're really moving around terminology very wildly here. And, is it, and so are you, because that's the tactics you play in your game. I, I mean, and you've he, done it the entire time. I, I mean, you've jumped from one subject to the next. You speak so fast, and I know how you work. So how does it feel to have it in your face? Oh, well, I mean... Hmm? Because I'm sick and tired of the shit that you have put against my community, especially black trans women. Because you constantly dis disregard all of our needs and then use us politically as a pawn when we're 1% of the population. Why not focus on the economy itself? All of us are struggling and you want to focus on trans people. You want to focus on a black woman when this is clearly a glass cliff situation. America's falling apart and let's give it a woman right when it's all falling apart when we'd had, what, 50 men run it and it looks like shit? Look at where we're at. Um... Truly, so, where, where do you think that we're heading? So, I mean, it's so funny to watch you, like, going white for... supremacy just fall apart the way that it is, and you ride so hard. Because guess what? In other countries around the world, women are not having children. And why is it? Because of the patriarchy and all the violence that men perpetuate, and all of this idea that abortion is somehow going to solve it all by forcing women to have abortion instead of focusing on the real problems that we're facing in our society. We're just going to completely ignore that, and we're just going to go, you know what? The line item is, let's make women have babies so that we can continue this capitalistic society that we have. Why are we doing that? What? I mean, why? Because you want to push white supremacy and because you want to make your check? It does great for you? Meanwhile, people like me have to live with the consequences of all of your rhetoric that you put on a daily basis. And including my entire community. And the intersectionalities of black women, men that experience SA, trans people, everyone that comes in. And I'm so sick of the idea that you can come in with this burrata, that you're this big guy that knows things because you can talk fast, you have statistics. But really, what does it really matter at the end of the day if you are harming the entire American? What, this guy's been accused of rape. Trump. In, like, court documents, and you're backing the guy. Like, you have children. How could you do that to your own? Don't you have a daughter? Like, what is wrong with you, dude? I've never seen such a party just completely just like the American idea, what we believe in as a country is not what you're perpetuating. It's diversity. It's giving you tired, hungry, and poor. The okay, Google pause. phone you have in your pocket pause. is because of pause. all of the diversity we've had. Pause. Pleasure to meet you. you